Alright guys, just out riding and uh, before I came out I had a I had a delivery from Amazon and this is the Bell 500 Custom and it's just a first impression this video that's all because I've, <laughs> I've only been riding with it for a couple of hours but I gotta say it fits really well really Im impressed and it feels pretty light for a th for a three-quarter helmet it's pretty light and uh, let's have let's have a look at it like I say it feels really comfortable and it's nice to have a I mean I got, I got a if you watch my videos you know I have a um, adventure helmet the, the um, adventure whatever the hell is called is a nice helmet but it's nice to it's nice to get out and have a three-quarter helmet uh, especially on this type of bike it just feels right <laughs> a bit of freedom a bit of wind in your face and it, it's real nice and the, the insides of this is uh, it's kind of like it's well, it's a leather inside stitched leather and it, it's really nice I you can you can stick those bubble visors on I don't have any of that yet the helmet just comes as the helmet that's that's it you don't get you don't get squat else <laughs> but um, I, I paid 129 bucks on Amazon if I can find a link I'll, I'll put the link in description and you can peel off the well actually on this one you can't but on the plain ones are coming loads of different colors from matte black to sparkly gold there's, there's a good color range but I, I like the black gloss and I, I like the uh, bronze in the in the middle uh, they call it bronze but it's kind of gold looking and it's got a gold trim on here and these are dot approved and um, ECE or whatever that is I don't know but Comfortable helmet so far, really comfortable, sticks to my head like glue and when I'm accelerating at the higher end uh, it's, it's not trying to come off my head and that's that's great. And my Adventure um, X9 or whatever it is, I, it has that peak and the tends to the helmet wants to lift off my head if I go above a certain speed. But. Um, Yeah, the, the, this is really cool. Uh, I like the history of the of this helmet. It goes back about 50 years or something like this, and it hasn't changed an awful lot. Good old D-ring um, fasteners there, and you've got a snap, a snap. It's just it's as basic as you can get. But they they look really good. Uh, I I love them. I love the look of them. If you're riding a chopper or an old classic bike or whatever, or you just want your face in the air with your sunglasses or goggles on. So that's it. Just quick video. Liking it so far. Pretty nice helmet. <laughs> that's it. Nothing else to say on it really. Time I went riding again. <laughs> Catch you later. <laughs>